Hey, it's Tori, and welcome to, or welcome back to my channel. <laughs> Today we have a brand new one from Reeves. Now, I absolutely love Reeves. I absolutely love Chris from Toronto is Broken and them coming together and working together on Reeves's solo album that she is set to release soon is just like a, a match made in heaven quite honestly and so she's dropped a brand new single called thanatosis now i'd never heard of this term before i did a quick google search just to see like what it is about and forgive me i'm gonna have to read from my phone but it says thanatosis is a defensive mechanism that involves an animal feigning death to avoid predators or other threats you know practically playing dead now of course i've heard of that before i just i didn't know it had a specific term for what it was called so i'm very curious uh for that subject matter because knowing reeves she's gonna completely twist it and make it like super dark and i can't wait this is also a big one for chris from toronto is broken um he messaged me earlier and he said um this is a big one for him too as it's his f first production and writing job you know he um helped her write this song and then he also produced it as well so I'm excited. I can't wait. And yeah, without further ado, let's just dive right in and check this song out together. I love those breathy vocals in the back. Is that the little bird you raised from an egg? In the first minute and Reeves has already shown us how much range she has within her vocals from those haunting breathy cleans to those completely stanky faced gutturals that we got oh my gosh oh gosh this is brilliant so far how prominent those drums are. That is totally not where I was expecting that chorus to go. I wasn't expecting Reeves to use her clean vocals in the chorus. I was expecting it to go like completely dark and dirty. While the instrumentation of it did, Reeves kept it really airy and breathy. And I love that contrast between those two. There's just something about it that really gives me goosebumps. Also, the production on this music video is absolutely gorgeous from the location to Reeves to 
the storytelling that she's doing throughout the video and then the editing it's it's gorgeous the color grading everything like the little i know <laughs> about editing <laughs> Love those like little synthies. Heartbeat. I gotta listen to that section again, again. I, this is one thing I love about Reeves. I love how she uses like the breathiness, the airiness in her vocals. And as we progress on, she then comes out with her full forced belt and it just really completely elevates everything. And also with the elevation comes the elevation of the instrumentation. And it like it's like elevating me up to wherever you believe in, you know. <laughs> and I just love that. It is like bird wings fluttering. I love the heartbeat. I'm gonna switch up. What a shot. There's so many layers going on here with the vocals. Another absolutely gorgeous song from Reeves and from Chris of Toronto is Broken, you know. Like I said, these two together are such a dream team. They're like soulmates in a musical way, if you think about it, that in those terms. And I just, I have been obsessed with reeves and toronto is broken ever since i first heard drip feed and since then i've just been 100 percent on board with everything that they do whether they do that together or they do that with other people and you know reeves and i have formed a really nice close connected friendship where she feels like a best friend to me you know I can go to her about absolutely anything and I did recently you know I, I was having a hard time with something and I went to her and, and 
I, I feel like I'm gonna cry. <laughs> and she just was so kind and judgment free. And that it, you just need people like that. And I'm also not one of those people where I expect a reply right away because I know what Reeves is like. And I also know how busy she gets. You know, not only is she doing her music, she also has a full-time job and, you know, her birds take precedence as well. You know, those are her babies. <laughs> um, and then, of course, with Chris, it's... I'm just so glad that I get to form these relationships with such talented people. And, you know, if I lived in the UK... I would totally have traveled for this day of filming so that I could assist in some way, whether that's assisting Reeves with her hair, her makeup, or her dress, whatever, pulling her along <laughs> by the rope, you know, because of course you need that tension and, and you need it to look real. Just something, something to help. Bringing food, bring, making sure Reeves is hydrated enough, you know, it, it, just something to say that that I helped and, and I would have done it for free. You know, because I just think it would have been fun. I think it would have been uh, a fun day of filming, of exploring and, and finding these perfect locations. But also then getting to see the behind the scenes aspects of it and seeing how what you see with your eyes isn't necessarily what you're going to see once it's all been cut together and edited and color graded and, and everything else that comes with that other creative side of the project so I just I really love these two Reeves your vocals in this next level I know I say this every single time and honestly you know I've had hallucination on my playlist and I and the day that came out I was literally I, I had to go somewhere in my car I remember sending you like a a photo of me listening to it in the car or you saw it on Spotify or something or, I don't know one of those we talk so much <laughs> and I just I, that whole car ride I just replayed it over and over and over again because it was just that good and this one I love how different it is but it's still your sound and it's still very you it's it's creepy and it's it's dark and it's got a uh, a whiff of mystery about it and that's what I love I love that you're very true to who you are as a person and as an artist so please don't ever lose that because that's what makes you reaps you know but yeah guys this was amazing Chris again on the production you, this was fantastic I really hope that it, artists who ever listen to this will now come to you because of course you set up your um it was at the end of the video. Is it uh, Drip Feed Productions or something? Sorry. I don't know if that came through. I gotta find it. Yeah. D oh, drip Feed Music. So if you guys need somebody to help with production or anything like that, please hit up Chris. I, I think they've set up um, an Instagram as well so you can find them there. I, need to, I think I've followed them on there. I'm not sure. I'll check it out after. But of course, I will leave everybody's links down below in the description. And also, if you enjoyed this, please please subscribe to Reeb's to Toronto is Broken because they are up and coming artists and they do only have a few thousand followers and subscribers. So yeah, I just love them. I, and, and we're trying to work out an interview between Chris and we've had Reeb's on before, but we're trying to get them back together because now this has become like uh, a joint project between them both so I think it would be fun to sit down and to talk with them both about what this means to them and, and how they came about forming this and, and everything that goes into that. You know me, I, I love that side of things. <laughs> anyway, I have ranted on long enough so yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe to become a Torian. Speaking of becoming a Torian, all of my social media links and my Discord link are down in the description. We'd absolutely love to have you come hang out in the Discord community and I will see you guys in the next video. Rock on.